What's up guys, my name is Bubble Play. Welcome to another episode of Toronto Blue Jays All Sim Franchise. We do, we are done with the off season, the last episode. We did a lot of stuff, it was pretty long. Now we will probably go through spring training, we will set up our roster for this year and we will go uh, as deep uh, into the season as time will allow us. Okay, so let's look at the rotations and all that stuff for... Spring training. This is not the final ones. Ray Caballero is the we yeah. I don't know why he listed as the starter. I think Danks Danks is a yeah. He's a veteran pitcher that we signed, so he should be one of our starters probably. Also, we signed yeah Derek Holland, another guy. So Cole Richard, yeah, he's pretty young. Justin Turner. Justin Turner may be in the rotation, we will see. Uh, okay, so a lot of prospects are in there actually, like 40 people <laughs> probably. And okay, that's pretty fine. Yeah, we will see. We will go with this rotation and then we will see how uh, everybody performs and who we should really keep. Okay. Lineups. Who do we have? We have Rubio. Yeah, this is basically this lineup is actually set up. McCoy and Cesar Cruz are all stars already. Cesar Cruz had 38 home runs in his rookie year, which is amazing. Elton McCoy uh, is a great contact hitter, 88 overall. He will be probably our superstar. Also, we have some players on the rise who are now, as you can see, all in their high 70s. Okay, yeah. And uh, yeah, all these young guys, we can try them in the spring training and then we can decide what to do with them. Joe Manuel, uh, he is actually doing pretty nicely. He had a great year. He can play second base, so this is kind of a situation where we need to really maybe make a decision. Jack Carney, yeah he can play shortstop and we don't have any I think. Let's look at our roster. Do we have any good shortstops? Yeah, no. We have uh, Chassin who is pretty far away still. Uh, we have Macias who is not really a top prospect so we really need to get some shortstops. It's the first thing and the... okay uh, Manuel, he can play second base. Yeah, he can play. So, what I think we should do, it will be the the best move. We need to put Jack Carney to shortstop. He will kind of uh, lose a little bit overall wise, probably. Shortstop Jack Carney. Yeah, you see, he's 78, so his fielding is worse. But I think this is something that we need to do. And uh, who is the better fielder? 62 and Joel Manuel is 43. So probably, on the other hand, Brett Laurie is kind of settled there. Yeah, you know what? Let's put Joel Manuel to second base and he will be playing third base. Uh, how will be. 76 overall, so actually he even likes it more, looks like. Well, that's fine, that's fine. 76 is good enough, and he will be our starting second baseman. So this is how we dealt with our infield. Uh, outfield, everything is pretty fine. Catchers, yeah, we have this young guy, he will be with us. And pitching, we will decide after the spring training. I want to take care about the... Training uh, regimen for all the new players. If we have any, do we have any? No, not really. Closing pictures. Yeah, those guys. You need to go to betting cages. Believe me, this is the best best thing for you. Betting cages for you. Who else do we have? Yeah, we have. In a weight room, we have those who already have like maxed uh, contact ratings. Like this guy, he is such a great hitter. You know what? He can play any other positions. This guy, look at his hitting. He is like... He's like the perfect DH, to be honest. 
Look at that. He's amazing. He's hitting clutch. Oh, man. Yeah, he is great. And, yeah, I think we will see how good he will be kidding in free agency or uh, in spring training. I don't know what I'm saying. And after that, we will probably put him as our DH because he is, like, the natural board hitter. And we can put him to the weight room for more uh, power. Okay. So... Yeah, now I think we can go till the last day of the spring training, like here. Yeah, auto fix lineups, it does not matter right now. Yeah, looks like, yeah, we have pretty decent spring training, looks like. We are, yeah, we, <laughs> two games over 500 and one game to go. Yeah, let's, yeah, we lost this game, so we won game over 500, but it's still nice. Let's look at the rotation. Stroman, well, I guess he's doing fine. Danks, amazing spring training. Holland, decent. Hutchinson, decent. And Turner, well, better than anybody could expect. Uh, those... So many relievers. Yeah, relievers, it's kind of a... Yeah, Lowell looks like he will be there. Like, if this guy, I don't know. I don't know if he had an Enix pitched. Yeah. Relievers, there's too many of them to tell. We kind of need to see what computer will decide to leave us with, and then we will figure it out. Rubio, nice hitting. Carney, could have done better, but probably all right. McCoy, playing like a star. Cedar Cruz, nine home runs. Armstrong, great job in left field. Lori, decent. Guillen, yeah, he need to learn how to hit still. Robert Roberts, you see, he is not the perfect choice for uh, DH. Goins, nice. Taylor, Manuel, Manuel is hitting nicely from the bench. It's a great job that he will be actually playing uh, with us the whole year. Cedeno, nice backup catching. Reggie McCann, 400. How many at bats he had? 10 at bats, 4 hits. Yeah, he kind of deserves this spot. So, what we will do, we will press the button and the spring training and now the rosters are set and what we need to do is we need to see what computer decided for us. Stroman is our first starter, Danks, Holland, yeah I can agree with that. This is a, not a great rotation but it's kind of solid. Corey Richard, he says that we need to put Corey Richard in there and Justin Turner yeah, I can agree with that. So yeah, Justin Turner, he can we can send him how how is his options are doing? We already used uh, one of his options. You know what? I probably want to send him down because I want him to get a consistent consistent starting and maybe in the middle of the year we will bring him up if he will be tearing it up. Sam Manning we can keep in long re relief because, well, he's 28 years old. No point in really seasoning him. Lowell, yeah, we need better re relievers. Lowell, Lowell is a good reliever, but he's like the only one true reliever. And we need two more of those. We need one long reliever and three those guys. Loop and Almanza. Well, I guess his pitching sets is actually looking pretty nice. So, yeah, I guess it's fine. And lineups, this is interesting. Let's see. Okay, I, w I see that we will do things a little bit differently here. Let's see, yeah, Rubio, nice contact hitting, perfect spot for him. Carney, nice. McCoy, Cruz, this is our 3-4 <laughs> punch, basically. Armstrong, nice. Laurie, nice. Guillen. And Manuel as the worst hitter. Yeah, that, that's kind of nice. And against left-handers, we have Rubio, Carney, McCoy. Yeah, basically it's the same, which I like, to be honest. And this is our bench. We need another catcher, that's for sure. Michael Taylor, we kind of need him. And Shimizu, yeah, this is what I... How many? We already probably... No, we haven't used his options. So this is the only difference that I'm going to make. I am going to... Put yeah, Robert Roberts. I don't know about him. I kind of yeah, Robert Roberts and Shimizu will go down, and we will bring one infielder and 
Uh, uh, what's his name? I forgot. Yeah, let's figure it out. Too many starters. Uh, Turner, I want to move him down for him to get a consistent starting. Sam Manning, yeah, he can stay. And Cesar Reyes, yeah, I want to send him down too. Okay, now we have six starters, which is nice. And now we need more relievers. Like this Sanchez guy, yeah, I want to see him. So we will move him on. Patrick Clark, you know what? Why not? We might as well use him. Okay. Cecilia Caballero will be our, our closer in AAA, which is perfect. Catchers, yeah, we're fine with catchers. Uh, first baseman, yeah, that's fine too. Uh, Buford Ellsworth, okay. Jack Carney, yeah, we are still a little bit short on infielders. So if I want to bring somebody up, I don't know who to bring up. Who is the best fielder? I guess this guy, uh, Macias. I don't know. Okay, so I want to send Shimizu down. I want him to succeed in AAA. And I want to bring Reggie McCain in. He will be our DH. And Robert Roberts. Yeah, I want to send him down too, in case he can really improve. He's too young. And we need to bring somebody else. I don't know who would I prefer to bring. Maybe we even need to sign somebody, I don't know. Okay. Maybe Warden Camper. But we already have Taylor as our backup infielder, so there is really no point in bringing another outfielder. Infielder. It's the other thing. Macias. Marshall Reyes. No, he's not a good. Oh, I guess Macias should. We should bring up Macias. Yeah, he can play a lot of positions. Yeah, it's actually. Yeah, we need to. He was not even on the 40 man roster. Okay. So he will be on our MLB roster. Okay. What we need to do next. Yeah, we need to set up the lineups. Uh, Reggie McCain and I kind of want to put him like here. Yeah, that's that's perfect. Uh, and against left, uh, is he hitting good against left hand? Yeah, he's almost as good as. It's basically the same thing. He will be our fifth hitter, both against left-handers and right-handers. Uh, here, who, who are we missing? Left fielders. Yeah, Armstrong can play there. Armstrong. Yeah, yeah, that's that's totally fine. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Uh, okay, also I want to set up our double-A lineup. This guy will be hitting here. This guy will be hitting... Uh, his natural position is right fielder, so he will be playing right field. And you can DH. Who do we miss? Shortstop. Yeah, well, I guess Reyes will be playing it. Yeah, that's fine. And in double-A... Oh, this guy, such a great contact rating. Yeah, that's fine. Mm. Against right-handers, the same thing. I want to put him in. And also... Yeah, like that. Same thing here. I want Shimizu to have like amazing year with a lot of RBIs, a lot of with a great performance. That's what I'm saying. 
and also we need to fix the rotation for Justin Turner will be first starter and who was this other guy? Mathis Simpson Perez yeah I wanna put Mathis probably should be in double A if when I think about it. Yeah, Mathis should be starting in double A. Sorry if this is taking so much time, but this is kind of a important thing to do. Mathis, where is Mathis? Yeah, here he is. We will move him to double A. And he will be starting there instead of this guy. This guy can be a long reliever. Such a long beard and 22 years old. This is just crazy. Okay, so I guess we pretty much set it, settled. Okay, who do we need? We need infielders to be honest. We don't really need pitchers. West and infield central. Those two guys will be discovering infielders for us. Okay, yeah, you can look at this picture. Okay. Now we can move on. Yeah, out of X roster, okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm just checking out time. We have around 10 minutes more. Infield East and Infield International. And you guys will be, you will be looking at those guys. Okay. <clears throat> well, we are one and two. Whoa! Oh, we swept Boston, which is actually pretty cool. And now Yankees. Can we win this series too? No, we can't. Yeah, they swept us. Okay. Oh, this guy, he 99 potential and he will be ready like really soon. Tampa Bay. Yeah, we're playing against our division rivals. Yeah, we split the series. We're around 500, which is uh uh Okay, look at the outfielders, whatever. And you look at this shortstop for me. Two games against Milwaukee. Nice wins. And now four games against Baltimore. Okay. 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 Three out of four. And we're three games above 500. This is what I like to see. Okay. Yeah, look at the left handed pitchers, for example. You look at the shortstop and you look at this third baseman. I'm really interested to see our stats. Yeah, we, we are doing pretty fine. Look at that. Turns out if we had... Oh, we swept Seattle. Look at that. I wasn't expecting us being so good so quickly. So this is actually really nice. Okay, look at the outfielders. Oh, no, no, no. You looked, you looked already. Okay. Oh... Uh, he says, you know what? No, you will be, if we don't really have, we need those infielders, so you will be looking at the infielders instead. Okay. We are second in our division, I think we are, yeah, we are first in wildcard race. We, we, we have, we are seven games above 500. Uh, Kyle Fowler, yeah, whatever. Everybody's hot. That's what I like to see. Strowman, amazing. Thanks, doing decently. Holland, well, decently Hutchinson, amazing, and Richard, so so. Mm, Lowell. Every, our bullpen is doing a nice job, looks like. Rubo hitting nicely. Carney. McCoy. Cruz. Only two home runs, but still, still fine. McCain is not really hitting too much for average, but four home runs, that's nice. Armstrong. We're not really hitting that good, but yeah, looks like. 
Yeah, looks like it's just clicking. Let's uh, go another couple of days. Okay, we won another series. Okay, you can look at left-handed pictures, international. Shortstop. Okay, Baltimore. What are we doing? 21 and 10. Who can... Who would have thought that this is what will happen? Yeah, relievers. I don't mind getting some relievers. Series against Seattle. We are probably leading our division. Wow, look at that. 23 and 11. Yeah, we are first. Okay, reliever, that's fine. St. Louis, uh, what we will do? Whoa! Okay, okay, we lost the series. It's the first in a long, long time. Look at all those wins. Seven wins in a row. That's that's just amazing. Now we have home and home against Atlanta. One nothing win. Three out of four. Amazing. Okay. Okay, look at the pictures. If you don't have anything better to do. Closing catchers, no. Those guys, no. Yeah, you can look at this guy. Nice short sub. Yeah, look at that guy. Chicago Cubs. Two out of three, and we score 10 runs in this game. Amazing. Okay. Man. Oh, Yankees catch, catch up to us. I was not expecting that. Yeah, they scouted everybody basically. Yeah, we'll be scouting infielders even if they they are not really. Oh yeah, this guy is nice. I want to know more about infielders especially. Detroit. Oh, they have a great series. Uh, they have a great record too. And we, oh, we got two out of four, which is. Should be pretty great. Okay. Any good short stops to no, they are yeah, this this guy is nice. Cincinnati, yeah, so far so good. Okay, two out of three. When you win series you you get a good record. You don't need to sweep everybody, but winning series is is the most important thing. Okay, second base. I like this guy and this guy. Okay, three games against Cleveland. Loss, win. Okay, yeah, it's a draft already. Let's go into it. We have ninth pick. And what can we go for? I want infielders. Like I said, yeah, this is too risky. Yeah, this is a nice third baseman, but um, those guys are really, really far away. Is there any good starting pitchers? No, nobody would really figure out. Uh, nice closer, but I don't think we need one. Yeah, looks like we need to pick up this guy. He is, yeah, he is closer to what we need and uh, he has a great potential. Yeah, let's pick him up. Yeah, 93. It's a nice draft pick actually. And another pick. Anybody we know for sure? Pedro Blanco. Like this guy, you see he is... Yeah, you know what? Let's, let's pick him up. 82. It's a decent uh, decent pick. No, 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 no. Those guys, yeah, now looks like it's time to just, you know, to uh, to gamble a little bit. Like, pick up this guy. Who is, turns out, well, well, we probably will sign him, but he's not anything good, really. Okay, uh, what else do we have here? 
Yeah, let's let's uh, yeah, let's pick up this guy. No, no, he he's he's bad. Well, whatever. Let's sim it. Okay. Mm, draft picks. Yeah, we had this guy is like amazing, a potential, great pick. Yeah, he accepted the offer. This guy also I want to sign. He is good. This guy, yeah, probably we will sign him too. And those guys, right fielder? No, no, no. Those guys I don't want to sign. Okay, so we are exactly at the end. Yeah, let's play against Cleveland to finish off the series. Yeah, nice win. 36 and 20. This is an amazing record. We are first in our division. And probably we are, yeah, we looks like we have... Only White Sox have better record, but they have one extra game. Yeah, we have the best record in the baseball. Okay, what I want to see is... No, no, no. I want to see what are we doing right. Betting average with 6. Okay, at bats it does not matter. Runs were 3rd. Hits, where we are? 17th, so not many hits. Doubles, triples, no, no, no. Home runs, do we give you hit a lot of home runs? Looks like not. 24th, so yeah, we are not really a home run hitting team. That's weird. Uh, but we score runs. Oh, we steal a lot of bases, we're first. Okay, we have best stolen base percentage. Do we walk a lot? Eight, that's fine, we strike out like Oh yeah, this is the least. We are the best contact hitting team. Looks like and slugging. Oh, we're good at slugging. Sixteenth, so yeah, not not that good. On base, we are fifth. Oh yeah, this is the secret. Contact hitting. Uh, really taking you know the, the bases and uh, just scoring those runs. Total bases. So this is how productive our offensive offense is, and it's not really. So we have really. Looks like we have really great average with... Uh, let me think, I forgot I forgot this word. With running, runners in scoring position, th this is what I was talking about. Errors, looks like... How good is our defense? Looks like not good. Yeah, 26, 6, so we're not good. Fielding, not good. ERA, yeah, our pitchers are really stepping up. This is amazing. Uh, shoutouts. Any shoutouts for us? Yeah, we have four by Stroman and Hutchinson, that's fine. Saves. Cecil has 16 saves. Okay, Blonze hits allowed. Runs allowed. Yeah, we don't really allow many runs. Especially earned. And not many home runs. And not walking anybody. Our pitching staff is doing a nice job, looks like. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So it's it's pretty weird so far I don't know yeah let's not look at that let's look at our pitching rotation once again Stroman 7 and 2 nice record 100 strikeouts amazing uh, 4 and 5 for, uh, 4 and 5 for Danks but he has a uh, nice ERA Holland 5 and 4 <coughs> decent ERA as well Hutchinson, like he's the league leader or something. Corey Richard, also nice for a rookie especially. Sam Manning doing a nice job in long relief. Lowell is getting hit around, looks like. Sanchez nice. Yeah, everybody, yeah, like this guy, yeah, we probably should not really put him in this spot. He should be just a reliever and Loop should be our only setup man. And Cecil is doing a nice job. Uh, saving a lot of games for us. And here, what do we have? 270, nice. 305, amazing. McCoy is playing like a superstar. Only seven home runs for Cesar Cruz, but... I know what, maybe we should make this move. I don't know. Yeah, we'll wait a little bit. Uh, yeah, McCain hitting greatly, but he's such a bad fielder and has no speed at all, but he's the perfect DH for us. Uh, who else do we have? Armstrong. Yeah, everybody's he hitting decent. Nobody's really, like, uh, hitting too bad. Well, our, our bench looks like they're not producing at all, but it doesn't really matter. 
My, it, what matters is that everybody except for Cruz, who supposed uh, to hit for power, everybody has like more than 250 almost. And this is, everybody is hitting and this is actually working pretty nicely for us. We are second best record in the baseball, leading our division and, well, I wasn't expecting those results as quickly. Uh, Caballero is doing nice, Chon is doing nice, Fowler is doing nice, Nandez, Cesar is Cezio. Oh, Shimizu is doing fine. Uh, what is Shimizu doing? How is he growing? Shimizu, he's already 72. Uh, 284. Great job. And Robert Roberts. Yeah, 10 home runs. Yeah, he's doing decent. He's growing slowly, but surely. Okay. Mm -hmm. Rubio is not really growing as fast as I would want him to, but still, he is pretty young. Armstrong is really filling this nice this place nicely before Shimizu will be ready to pick it up, which probably will be next year, maybe in the middle of this year. We will see. Carney is doing nicely. Lori is growing. Uh, Manuel, how good is he hitting? Uh, 267, uh, that's nice. And he's only 21 years old. Cruz, yeah, we know all about him. Guillen, well, for 20 year old catcher, he is doing a fine job. And Bullpen, yeah, Bullpen is our weak spot, kinda, but they also are performing nicely. Okay, so I guess we'll finish it off here. This was really awesome. I wasn't expecting such a good results as fast as like in our third year. Is it our third year? Is it really? 14... No, no, it's our fourth year. So yeah, that's that's nice. So uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed it. Uh, follow me on Twitter, subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.